Ugh, the decryption minigame. I hate the decryption minigame. I hate this game so much. <clears throat> Open the door, in we go. Humans, thank the maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. How did you end up in this shed? We hid here during the attack. They must have come here for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit... unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. So, on your second playthrough of this game, it's quite obvious that Manuel activated the beacon from what he says. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the Dow trees and investigation. I'm only going down this road so I can shut him up. Say good night, Manuel. You cannot silence the truth. My voice must be heard. Oh my God! What did you do? That might have been a little extreme, Commander. You can't just go around whacking people in the head. Just a little bump on the head. Let him sleep it off. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. Williams, take us to the spaceport. Good luck, Commander. So here we go, it's time to spaceport. Is there anything else in here apart from no. I don't Yeah, I only really got in there just to punch him in the head. Nope, oh, more things. Shotgun and a sniper's rifle. Oh that's I need to work out how to get rid of that. Uh yes. Better damage, not as accurate, um, so not really. Uh, I prefer accuracy in my sniper rifles. Saren. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Look, there's, there's subtle hints at points that um, Saren is actually spoiler alert indoctrinated um, and sovereigns Off taking control. It's a ship. Look at the size of it. Look at that beautiful bastard. Dem Reapers. Oh, it it's the Geth. Uh the grenade. So it's it's a good thing I've got aim assist on. <laughs> I really suck at games. Ugh. Right. This door. Oh, before we go what's in the what's in the box? 
some Omni 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 gel. Hit the damn button. I hate this mini game. Sucks. There we go. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out, we're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah, uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. Knew it was trouble the second I saw it, so we made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. Well, the three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned, only it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. More it like... made it impossible to think. It was trying to assume direct control. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. If there's something you're not telling me... Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You're breaking the law, Cole. We're not hurting anybody. Hell, most of the time I don't even know what's in the packages. Just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? Yeah, there's one more thing. I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. Uh... Okay, forget about it. I've got more important things to worry about. Good luck. Uh, what have we got? Uh, Stinger 2, decent pistol, and combat sensors. None too shabby. So, get away. So, let's upgrade the rifle. Um, yep. Give it the sensors. Caden. Uh, you can get the pistol. Should have kept it for myself. It's red. So, what's what's in here? Anything else? Ah, oh, you were so holding out on me. There's a storage locker. I so had that. Ah, uh, we got ooh armor. Yeah, these guys were. Easy holding out on me. So, armor. Uh, it's Caden that wears the light armor. So, that's not as good. That's not as good. So, yeah, Caden's got his best armor I can put on him right now. I think Ashley has too. I was like, what are these? What's this ring on the border of my screen? But it's, the, it's the detection. Oh no, it's not the detection. <laughs> it's my accuracy, because <laughs> for some reason I've got this sniper rifle out. 
Why do I have the sniper rifle out? Why? No, where's the where's the button for changing weapons? There we are. There, that's better. Why was I running around with a sniper rifle? Oh well. Commander, it's Nihilus. Let's investigate the dead spectre. A Turian? You know him? He's a spectre. He was with us in the north. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Pal. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I, I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? <laughs> Let, let's be honest, who here hasn't went and had a nap at work? Um, yeah. If you hadn't snuck off for that nap, you'd probably be dead just like all the others. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. I don't really want to think about it. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. He is a true champion king. What is going on with my textures? Oh. Leave me alone! Troubles. Ah. Ah! Right. Ah, oh, that's Asha. No, um, overload. No. Uh, throw. Ah, there we are. And throw. Throw away. Switch to my sniper's rifle. Nope. Go uh, everywhere, 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 everywhere. Nope. <laughs> I suck. <laughs> I suck at aiming. Uh, I'm not even moving the mouse. Oh my god. Let's. No. Oh. Note to self. No more sniping. Run up, run up, run up, get the cover. Cover. They're so far away I can't even see them. Boom. Got one. Got another one. one over there. 
short controlled bursts. Got him. One more. Down. I'm <laughs> I'm better at sniping with an assault rifle than I am with a sniping rifle. Wow. Medigel. Medigel. Wow. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to save it. There, before I go hit the train controls, I'm going to save, I'm going to retweet the graphics, and I'm going to come back.